Welcome back to the Sports at Night show for segment two. As we, uh, we're going to finish off the AFC North. And the next team on the list is the Cleveland Browns. Oh, yes. Hmm. <laughs> And uh, I, I hope I don't come off as biased, but I think we're going to have a fun year this year. Am I, am I jumping on the hype train? Probably not, because, you know, I remember the last time we jumped on the hype train? We failed. And, yeah, we, we've, we've shut down the kitchens, and we've opened up. Uh, let me rephrase that. we shut down the kitchens, and now we have Kevin, a qualified Kevin Stefanski as our, as our head coach. And hopefully turn this um, squad of underachievers into potential Super Bowl contenders. Whether or not we get to the Super Bowl, well, that's up to them. And I'm hoping, and, and the only problem is, am I going to die before the Cleveland Browns win the ring? <laughs> but uh, let's take a look at the schedule. The first team we play is the Baltimore Ravens at... M&T Bank Stadium in Baltimore, Maryland, and uh, and uh, I feel like I feel like we're, we'll be confident, we'll confident, and I think if we play play properly and you know don't commit eighteen penalties, like we did last year, might have a good might have a good game. Are we gonna win this? Probably not, but you know, I mean it'll be cool to like open up one and zero. We'll beat the Bengals and we beat the Redskins. Two easy wins. Then our next challenge. In Dallas against the Dallas Cowboys. Hmm. I, I'm going to say take a loss here. I mean, Dallas is just too good. Like, Dallas is like, scary good, really. I got pimples everywhere. <laughs> Probably shouldn't have said that, but I don't know how to edit videos in this. Yeah, let me know in the comments below and uh, on how to, you know, edit edit videos and whatnot. Oh, and make sure you subscribe. Hit that subscribe button down there. Hit the like button next to it so we can get, so I can, so I know uh, if you appreciate this video. And uh, remember, we are continuing our quest to 1,000 subscribers. That would be a milestone. Well, actually... If you think about it, a milestone would be 5,280 subscribers. Or 1,790 subscribers. Or 63,360 subscribers. Get it? 5,280 5, feet, 1,790 yards, 63,360 inches. Uh, anyway, we're getting off topic. Okay, so, yeah, we're going to take a loss to the Dallas Cowboys. Sorry, I just don't see us beating the Cowboys in any way. I, I feel like we could beat the Colts, though. So now we're three and two, and ooh, against the Pittsburgh Steelers in Pittsburgh. You remember what happened the last time we played the Steelers? You know the whole Miles Garrett incident, and that we started, and uh, they started a thing, and the and like and Miz, and then Miles Garrett accused Mason Rudolph of being a racist, even though there was clearly no evidence to support this. And it seems like even when we find a way to win, we still find a way to lose. But Miles Garrett, Miles Garrett is back, and I will be doing a sports breakdown analysis, NFL team analysis. It's gonna be a little late, but uh, but but I'll probably do it like right before the season starts. No, the thirty, or we'll call it the thirty-two days before, thirty-two days, thirty-two teams. That's what I'll call it. Or you let me know in the comments below what you want to call it. Anyway, honestly. Against the Steelers, I don't see us. I don't see us taking it in Pittsburgh, but definitely in Cleveland. Cause I mean, you know, Big Ben is back, but the question is: Is he going to be healthy, and is he going to be the same Big Ben? That's the problem. So we're going to take a loss here. So we're three and three. We go four and three, five and three. We're going to beat the Bengals and the um, um, Oakland Raiders. I'm sorry, the Las Vegas Raiders. Why the heck did you lose? Why the heck did you move to Vegas? I do not know. We're gonna beat the Texans, so now we're six and three. So so far, pretty good. Now we got the Philadelphia Eagles. Oh boy. 
it's in it's in Cleveland at least. You know what? I'm calling upset. We're gonna we're gonna go seven and three. You're gonna hate me for this. Philly faithful is gonna hate me for this, but I think we're gonna beat the Eagles. We're probably gonna lose, but <laughs> you know. So it's cool to see an upset here and there. All right. Next next up on the list is the Jacksonville Jaguars. We're gonna beat them, no doubt. We're gonna go eight and three. And all we need is one win to guarantee a winning record. All right, next up on the list is the Tennessee Titans. Ooh. It's in Nissan Stadium. I don't think we're going to win this. So we're going to go 8-4. and four. And, I don't, and we're not sweeping the Ravens, so that's now 8-5. That's now Uh-oh. But we beat the Giants and the Jets. And they're both it at MetLife. So, so now that's 10 wins. Look at that. And we'll beat the Steelers. So now we go 11 and, 11 and 5. Oh, are we going to hit 11 wins? Probably not, but it would be cool though. Alright, all right, we'll, I'll be back for one more segment. And we'll talk about the Pittsburgh Steelers.